So, could you tell me about how, how you went about making it, or what's, what's the concept behind it? Well, like the uh, title dictates, Voyage is a um, sort of a, a vessel, and uh, inside the vessel there's this uh, egg made of fiberglass. Um, and so it's, uh, it's uh, a visual metaphor of, of uh, my experience as an immigrant. Okay. Uh, my family came from uh, Valparaiso, Chile, uh, back in 1981. <clears throat> and um, uh, not from that point on, but a few years later when I started becoming more serious about uh, art and uh, uh, making art, um, that the idea of using my experience as an immigrant um, as, a, as a visual uh, metaphor. Of. A lot of my work also um, still reflects the roots, literal and uh, mm -hmm. metaphorical, you know, to, to where I'm from and what they mean, you know, roots being, you know, something that you're, you know, that's very much the core of, of who you are as a person uh, and then, you know, taking, yanking that person or that thing away from one place and take it into another place. And so, okay. so, you know, most of my work reflects that experience as an immigrant. Cool. Mm -hmm. Is there anything in, in this work or in any of your works that you think about sonically ever? You know, I've never really thought of it that way, but um, that would be an interesting challenge in the future. Um, I have thought, however, about um, using water. Is, uh, mm. is, is one of my pieces. You know, I, I try to utilize a lot of you know natural right. elements. Right. Wood is a it's a very um, common thing. It's you know easily accessible. Uh, I get a lot of my stuff actually from the river, from the Mississippi. Oh. Honestly, I think I'm very curious to, to see what you come up with. Uh, you know, your, your your music piece or you know the student's music piece based on this particular uh, sculpture. Yeah. I'm well, I can tell you what attracted me to it. Mm -hmm. um, so I really like working with wood sounds. Okay. Um, uh, sound like especially uh, doing electronic music having a reference to the more organic in it you know because electronic music is is just not based on anything in the physical world you know it's your instruments you use don't have to subscribe to any physics any laws of physics um, so I can I could make an instrument um, well I could make an algorithm that would be as if I was plucking you know the those the, the sticks on it. Okay. Um, and also the wood sounds are just they're not sharp, they're they're good for percussion, they're good for ambience, you know, they're a lot of what I do is, you know, wood sounds. I mean I'm first of all Thank you for your interest. Thank you for choosing the Guthrie. Thank you for, for letting me be here. Yeah, it's just, it's yeah. really great. Um, I, I, so, I am so curious to know more about, um, you know, what your plans are for this project. Well, my main interest in music is, is film scoring, which is, you know, putting music mm. to picture or music to some form of art. And uh, really gave me this opportunity to try. I've never tried putting music to a building before. Mm -hmm. um, but I know that a lot of architecture comes from music and they interact with each other very well. Something that I'm that I'm curious about is is the building. It's a very it's very it's a very you know optically interesting building. It catches your attention. And we also talked about how it fits in with um, with the scenery and, and, and the city. And I'm just curious as to what people's reactions are when they come. Mm -hmm. Are they are they a little, you know, you know, off taken? Do they is it you know, how do they usually react to it? It's a great question. And there, as just as there are many, many different kinds of people, there are many, many mm -hmm. different reactions to the building, although they do fall into two camps. You know, some people will look at the building and think that, whew, that's a little too different for right. me. You know, I'm not quite ready for this. It's not what I'm used to. Um, and, and they kind of will think of it as maybe cold. Mm -hmm. um, I would, however, say the majority of people um, are very excited by the idea of the building and by being inside the building because it is, it is different and it is unique and it is um, not like anything they've seen before, um, especially in the city of Minneapolis. You know, it's, I think sometimes um, people will think of music or photography or, you know, architecture um, or dance as, 
you know, sort of silo art mm -hmm. forms, um, but but that's not true, is it? No. Yeah. I think, um, especially as I've grown older and, and, and gone more depth into music, I've found that that art, it just, uh, all of it works together. All of it works, mm -hmm. um, and I, especially I find finding music, music just, you know, in my life, just falling into all these different categories and really taking an interest in, in how music works in, in film and in, and in and how it influences people and how it inspires people. Mm -hmm.